Start things, here we go. And action. What? Someone's got to save your career. I'm pretty sure... 16-year-old actress Eliza Taylor Cotter plays Janae in Neighbours. Janae is every inch the mature girlfriend in her steamy relationship yeah. with Boyd. I can be the bored, sexy housewife and you can be the hunky gardener. I'll go get my overalls. I don't think you're getting them. <laughs> but when she kissed on screen for the first time at the age of 15, it was an experience she never forgot. My first ever kiss was my um, first kiss on Neighbours. I'd never kissed a guy before. <laughs> and. Um, and I was so nervous, I mean, not having, you know, ever actually kissed anyone before and then having to do it in front of a crew of people, you know, it was so, um, so nerve wracking. But luckily, there's always a director on hand to give tips on your kissing technique. Just hold it there, guys. Put a bit more feeling into it or, you know, well, it's you just know, looking a bit stale. Can you stale. put your head that way? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So it's not only, it's not only the fact, like, <laughs> It's not just the fact that you're kissing someone in front of people, but you've actually got to do it a certain way too. And mm. it feels, sometimes it can feel very awkward. It'll look maybe oh. okay on camera, but I've it'll feel shockers. really weird, like weird head angles or yeah. <laughs> weird hand actions. It looks <laughs> fine on the telly, but we could like, you know, we, they put us in some very strange positions. Yeah. <laughs> Action. But you know what? I, I don't believe that they would ever have an affair. Have you actually sat down? Some soaps are prepared to tackle the most serious consequences of teen sex, like getting a sexually transmitted disease. The car just said that in the first place. Watching storylines such as Janae's and Neighbours um, with her HIV scare definitely brings it home um, not to be irresponsible about things like safe sex because I always just relate myself if I was in that situation and by seeing it on TV because you never think about it especially you know in everyday situations like when I'm out with my friends I never think of the impact of what my actions are like I never do but watching stuff like that really brings it home. I take it you didn't always use protection? Just once. Right. Well, you've done the right thing coming here to be tested, then. Yeah, um, what are the odds? Unfortunately, there is a real chance that he's passed on the disease. That scene with um, Carl and Janae was really good. Like, I thought that that actually genuinely, like, because most of the that time, when because you can tell when, when sort of, obviously, TV, you know, broadcasters are trying to inject a bit of, like, these are the issues you need to get across. Mm. And they do it really, really obviously. But obviously, that, that, was, that was quite obvious, but... It was realistic as well, and and you could sort of think you felt like, oh my god, imagine, and then Stomach you suddenly turning feeling, yeah, and yeah. you suddenly thought, oh god, hang on, you, it's quite easy to get you know, HIV, and it's quite a scary thing, and you can actually just die, and 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 that was that was good, that really worked. The neighbor's storyline with Janae might have been difficult to watch, but it was even more harrowing to act. I just completely and totally lost myself in those scenes, I think, um, uh, to the point where I had to kind of remind myself that I, I, I'm not Janae, I'm Eliza and I'm completely healthy <laughs> um, coming off set. 